What's that you hear? The roaring sound of a massive creek. I'm here in Allegheny National Forest. I'm gonna show you a dispersed campsite I just found. It's perfect site, I think. Let's take a look. Here we go. What's all this down here? Rushing water. I just pulled in. I think this is what I'm gonna take. It's not the best place for a tent, but my goodness, get up in the morning and have a seat here. Let's go down and take, take a look. Oh my gosh. I've never been to a prettier site. I don't feel like I could drink that water. It's so clear. And it's... There's my Jeep. That's where my camp will be, my tent. I wasn't kidding about this site, huh? I can't get, I have no cell. I just sent my wife a, my GPS a coordinates to my in reach. And I'm gonna set up my tent real quick. And so I can sit down and enjoy the, the sounds. I wanna get this up, it's starting to cloud up.
this all night long. I will take it. For dinner tonight, I'm gonna have red beans and rice and some Polska kibasa. Cooking with this view is pretty awesome. Added the beans and rice. Now that I'll put these over. Getting good. Let's stir it up. I think the beans are starting to pop. Oh, well, there it is. Red beans and rice all mixed up. Sausage. Sit down, eat, and enjoy the sound. Good. Mm. Well, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my meal and this view here for a little bit. I'll get back with you. Great, I kind of got a place to wash. I wish I could drink that water or know if you could boil it or drink it. But I won't. Wow, this is great. It's starting to get dark. About 20 to 9. Got my fat wood. Got some good birch leaf bark. Still on five strikes. Let's see. What do you guess? I lost. I don't know, I don't got a very good setup, do I? Let me see, no. We're okay. Praise the Lord. I don't have any matches. But that should do it. 
Well, we got the fire going. You can hear the water. And it's just constant noise. I should, they say everybody sleeps so well. I remember I camped at uh, Tar Hollow Campground and down by a creek that rushed all night too. And I did it, it slept, slept very well, but I, you really can't hear anything around you other than water right now. So that's a little unnerving, but I've got my senses up, my bear spray, my other things to protect me. So I think I'm good to go. Through the water, and the fire's getting going, it's starting to get cool. I have my iPhone camera just better in the dark than the GoPro that I have. I just want to say it's, it's getting about 10 o'clock, 10, 15, but I'll get ready for bed, brush my teeth and stuff, and then I'll see you guys in the morning and let you know how this roaring river sound helps. Does it help me sleep or does it keep me up all night? But I think it'll relax me and just kind of be good white noise to help me sleep. But what a great view today and uh, what a good time so far. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Ground up some coffee yesterday in my portions. Yeah, it smells good. I burned myself too many times. Everybody has their own formula. I go about five minutes. This has got to be one of my best moments I've had since I've been camping. Just with the view, the sound. It's really awesome here. It took me five and a half hours to get here, but on the way you're sitting there wondering, wow, was it worth it? Then you get here, you go, yeah, it's worth it. Got my coffee, got my word, diary, things to think about, and my breakfast. Really good coffee, and uh, enjoy the scenery, and enjoy the word for a while before I head out and go overlanding. Hey, after I finish my coffee, I'm going to get up and go overlanding. And man, do I find some great places to camp further into Allegheny National Forest. So what you're going to see is me going around and finding some new places to camp. And then I fall in love with one that's much different than where I'm at tonight. And that, that will be in part two. But take a look at this as I find some really interesting places to camp. Straight cruising, headed for bruising, watching out for number one. You gotta slow down, look around you, son. Today is just today and not tomorrow.
Last night, I thought I found an epic campsite. Oh my gosh, look at this. Okay, you got the fire ring. And then you have a creek going all the way around this thing. Look at this. How pretty is that? Man, I almost feel like I should come over here and camp tonight, pack up everything from where I'm at. This is really secluded though, and I can't get my Jeep back here. My Jeep is over there. So I get back in my Jeep after that great campsite I just found, and I marked it. I definitely have to camp there sometime in the fall and winter. What a great place that will be. So after I turn around, I get going, and I find, as I continue to overland, I find another great spot. And this time, it's enough to pull me away from that stream where I camped last night, and I move to this new site. So you'll get a taste of me heading back, but stay tuned for my next video, where you'll see me where I find my next great spot to camp here at Allegheny National Forest. Your head, where you go.